Morning server are talked about the information age. Introduction. The information age is considered a historic period in the 21st century, characterized by the rapid shift from the traditional industry, and also called computer age, the digital and new media age, and is marked by a very fast growth in communication and information technology. This age holds a significant influence as educators and learners. The invention of the computer which people access the information with the touch of the bottom. So, it's defined by rapid growth in communication and technology. The key player in the community granting instant access to information, making it highly influential for educators and learners. Historical development, the information age also referred to as computer ages and new media age. As a historic period in the 21th century characterized by the rapid shift from the tra traditional industry, it began around the 1970s and is still going on today. This era brought a time period in which people called access information and knowledge easily. As in field of literature, the Renaissance influenced this age by creating idea, invention that lead to modern ones. So, the information age starting around the 1970s mark a significant shape from traditional industries to a time where information and knowledge become easily accessible. Information age also referred to people, information, and societies that chronic the birth and growth of electronic information of ancient Time to Samuel Morse's invention of the telegraph in 1970s. Throughout the development of the telephone, radio, television, and computer. So there are four period of information. First, pre-mechanical 3000 BC to 1450 AD. Second, mechanical 1450 to 1840. Third, electro electromechanical. 1840 to 1940 then fourth electric electric information 1940 present some pioneers who belong to this period were blaise pascal alexander graham bell Stephen Wozniak, Stephen job and bell gates so during the information age pioneers like blaise pascal alexander graham bell and Modern innovators like Steven Wozniak, Steven Jobs, and Bill Gates play a crucial role. They could contribute to the development of technologies that transform how we communicate and access information, laying, a, laying the foundation for the digital era we live in today. Personal computers had become widespread by the end of the 1980s. The internet was developed during the 1970s in the early days it was used. In the, 19, in the 1990s, the World Wide Web was developed mainly for commercial purposes. New, new services were created to sell products. Now, airline tickets, hotels, reservation, books, and even cars and houses can be purchased online. So, Cloud Channel regarded as the father of the information age. Living in the information age, effects and impacts. Technology is increasingly playing a crucial role in the success of organization, particularly in school in this information age. The impact of IT has been enormous on various domains, including education, computers, and the information they process and store have transformed every aspect in the society. Since we live in the information age, IT has become a part of our everyday lives. There have been tremendous changes in the ways people live, work, and play over the past three decades. Technological innovation and entrepreneurship have been the key players in the changes that we experience. In the information age, technology, especially computers IT, have become vital for the success of organizations, notably in schools. It has profoundly influenced education and society as a whole. 
Think about how computers have changed in the way we live, work, and play in the past 30 years. This shift is mainly driven by technological innovation and entrepreneurship, shaping our everyday lives. From the way we learn in school to how we conduct businesses, technology is a fundamental part of our modern existence. Every day, we use technology in new ways. Computers are becoming increasingly affordable and they continue to be more powerful as information processing tools. Some of the advantages of information technology are Number 1. Globalization It has brought the world closer together, led to sharing information more quickly and efficiently, and enable countries to share ideas and information with each other. So it helps people from different countries share information faster and more efficiently, making the world feel closer together. Number two, communication. It has made communication cheaper, quicker, and more efficient. The use of internet opened face-to-face -face communication from different parts of the world. Through this, you can now communicate to your family through messenger, Skype, and etc. Number three, cost effectiveness. It has led to computerization of business processes and increased productivity that gave more profits, better pay, and working conditions. Businesses use computers to do their work efficiently, which means they can make more money. This often leads to better pay and working conditions for employees. Number four, creation of new jobs. It has led to the opening up of opportunity for computer programmers, system analysis, hardware and software developers, and web designers. Because of technology, new kinds of jobs have been created. It opens up more opportunities for people. The information age has introduced changes in the different aspects of people's lives because of the following. Number one, emerge of online companies. The rise of companies on the internet means you can how buy things connect with people, and get information without leaving your house. Number two, creation of economically and stimulating business. New exciting businesses have created, bringing innovative products and services that make life more interesting and convenient. Number three, more mature and educated people. People today are more knowledgeable and experienced thanks to the improved education and access to information, making the better equipped to navigate a modern world. That's all for today. Thank you.